I wanted to share with you a quick trick when it comes to getting refresh errors in Power BI. What you can do is scroll down with the scroll bar and get to whatever uh, whatever load was canceled, this is the message that you'll see. Load was canceled by an error in a previous table. Well, you might see five or six of these up at the top of the screen, and then you'll need to use this scroll bar to get down to see really truly what the culprit is. So in this example, it's telling me that this particular query, plan portfolio, has a column overall in, in this table that has a duplicate value of on track. Well, this didn't make any sense to me because as you know, if you have sta a status column, or you know, in this case, it's an overall status column in my table, of course you want more than one value for on track. Hopefully all of them will be on track for your overall status. So I was suspicious of why this was giving this error because I knew this should not have been the field that was used to establish that one-to-many relationship. So what I do is I go into Power BI and I look at the reports, I go to the modeling tab, and I click manage relationships. And once I do this, I can find where that culprit is. And here it is, the project portfolio overall. Well, why is it causing that error? It's not checked, so this relationship is not being used right now. Well, this is my main message. Don't trust this checkbox. If you get an error, you still should go in here and you should delete this. It's not being used anyway, so just highlight the row, click delete, and then your refresh will succeed. Good luck.